Hi everyone, Mark Lyman with HomeFixated.com here, and today I'm going to tackle a big topic, and that is determining who makes the best tool between Channel Lock, Klein, and Milwaukee. In particular, who makes the best bottle opener? Now I've got three tools here from those three brands. This is the uh, the entry from Channel Lock, Milwaukee's bottle opener, and finally Klein's. So. Uh, I've been doing a lot of field testing on these. These have come with me to various uh, parties, social events, uh, having people over at the house, and in uh, some personal testing as well. And uh, I've spared no expense in testing these various bottle openers. As you can see, we've got a couple test uh, bottles right back here. So uh, let me tackle these one by one. Let's start off with the channel lock. Now, uh, this, is, this was actually a very popular opener uh, with with some of the beer drinking crowd that I hang out with, it's uh, it feels good in your hand. It's got kind of this rounded uh, back to it, and that feels good in the palm of your hand. Where where it kind of lost me though is this triangular shape at the at the front. So there's kind of an up and a down to this. We, this makes sense to open it this way, right? You've got your thumb there. Uh, it's oriented to to lift the bottle cap up. If you flip it over the other way. Your thumb's either got to go on the side, which is kind of a little weird, uh, or you're putting it on the top where it's not really designed to go. So, you know, fine motor skills are one of the first things to go when, when people are drinking. And I think that this one just, it's a little too finicky as to how you have to grip it. Um, yeah, sure, you can have your hand at an angle and still do it. Uh, I've just, I'm not a personal fan of it. So just because of that, I'm eliminating channel lock. Sorry, channel lock. On to Milwaukee. Uh, Milwaukee and Klein share a very similar design. It's kind of a, uh, almost like a screwdriver shaped design. It's got a nice icon on the back that lets you know, hey, this is your, your bottle opener, just in case you've got it mixed in with a bunch of tools in your tool belt. And uh, it's just a, a good solid feel in your hand. Uh, you can grip it, you know, it can be upside down, right side up, doesn't matter. Uh, it's gonna do the job. Where Milwaukee lost me, though, is the inclusion of this wire stripper. So I know that, that Milwaukee uh, uh, likes to party, but I'm really curious how that came about uh, when they were discussing this tool. Hey, let's, let's mix alcohol with electricity and put a wire stripper on here. So, you know, I don't know, maybe it's just a personal fear that if I drink enough beer, I'll look at this wire stripper and decide it's a great idea to go out and strip some wires. I, for whatever reason, it just the whole wire stripping beer thing just doesn't work for me. So unfortunately, I had to eliminate Milwaukee too. So that leaves us with the Klein bottle opener. All around great design. Like the Milwaukee, you can grip it pretty much however you want to grip it. Uh, it's got a rubberized grip, so if things get a little sloshy, you can still maintain a grip on your opener, which is great. And uh, it's also the longest tool in the bunch, so in terms of leverage, uh, the advantage goes to Klein as well. It does also have an icon on the back, so if you have this in your tool belt, you can see it's got kind of a bottle cap icon on there. No mistaking it for your screwdriver. It's a great all-around opener, and uh, congratulations, Klein. You won the Home Fixated Bottle Opener Challenge. For more great uh, tool reviews, products for around the home, how-to projects, DIY tips, be sure to drop by homefixated.com. Look forward to seeing you there.